As much as I preach to keep your body in shape and be mindful of what you eat, I keep that same energy when it comes to my pets, guys. Right now, we're currently outside at a park. We've done four miles total. Uh, we're probably gonna top off um, around like five, uh, but it's gonna be walking. Their goal was to do a one mile walk. Um, as you guys may be aware or may not be aware, I have a Facebook group for outdoor adventurers with their pets. And we're doing a challenge right now where um, it's a minimum of a mile uh, to just be active, but not just you be active, include your pets as well. The goal behind it is get these big, beautiful dogs and then let them rot away inside all day, you know? Get them outside, get them in their outdoor environment so they can be active and they can share that time with you. As you guys can see, I have a Dogo Argentino, very active dog, American Pitbull, another very active breed. Then I got the, <laughs> the Bully, who's semi-active, but not really. Um, but I like to bring them outside, give them uh, that space to just enjoy nature um, and be happy, guys. Like, these dogs need to be outside. They need to have different stimulations. Right now, there's a whole plethora of smells that they're taking in, right? Depression is real in animals too, guys. When you keep your dogs, like, look look at them. Look how happy they are right now. You can tell. They've been doing this for like the last 20 minutes, just running around circles around me. You know, you can tell they enjoy these activities because that's what they're meant to do. Like we domesticated the wolves and then we just set them in our house, guys. I don't know about you, but as I get older, I'm moving more towards like a natural living and I want to be just more outside in nature around with my animals and just enjoying the beauty of life. There's an old saying that goes, the best thing in life are free. And I'm starting to realize that we get so caught up in all the modernization, wanting <sighs> all these crazy things that we forget to appreciate the luxury of life. Like this is free, this view. I didn't pay nobody for this view. I didn't pay anybody for the joy that my dogs are having right now. It's free. Happiness is free, guys. You gotta just look for it. And you gotta see it when it's there. Let them know. Say what? Happiness is what? Happiness is free. Look how beautiful this man is. I mean, handsome. <laughs> My little Dogo right here. He's only six months. Six months old. It's gonna be a beast. Go play, go play. And then this is Chanji. Alahaji Chanji right here. Come here, come say hi, Chanji. He's so, oh my God. You haven't done that much work. And you're already out here. Anyway, guys, I just wanted to top in, do a little vlog. We've done so far. Let me check. Total five miles. We ran three of those, and we've been walking the other two. We're gonna clock out. Probably six or seven total miles. Um, but yeah, every day is adventure. You just gotta be able to see the opportunity that life presents. Check out this view, South Georgia. And we're 
with that being said, you guys have a great day. Be blessed. Let's get healthy together with our pets. And if you're interested in joining our Facebook group, I'm going to put the link below in the description. Um, if you join the Facebook group, share your story with your pets. That's what we do in there. And then join the challenge, a minimum of one mile a day. Or outside, outdoors, whether it's walking, hiking, biking with your pets. Let's get active. <laughs> get it, get it, get it, Enzo. Get it, Enzo. Get it, Enzo. Get it. Enzo. Get it. Enzo. Get it.